Good evening, all. This is Big Larry. As I'd go live when I got home, I got home. I did not make it to the courtroom. Which you all know that because Vaughn Hilton's already posted it. Larry didn't show up at court. I was in the home. I was rushed to the hospital by the ambulance. I collapsed on my way off the porch. So it sounds like I got another court date in a week, week and a half. I go back. I just wanted to get on here and let everyone know that I did not go to court. I heard Vaughn Hilton did a lot of lying up there. That's fine. He ain't going to be lying when I get there. I just wanted to get on here. I'm hurting pretty bad. I hit the ground pretty hard. Got a bruise across my back. I didn't go, baby Jane. I ended up going to the emergency room. My legs literally collapsed on me and I hit the ground. I was having chest pain, so the wife called 911. But the wife did go up there. And she told the wife that she couldn't tell her anything because she's not on the lease. Funny thing is, there is no lease. So this is going to be fun. Wait till I can't. I, man, I hope I can make it to court this coming week. Two more pills on me this week. He's got me taking a couple other pills. He said my blood pressure was real low. And that's why I got hot, dizzy, and just collapsed. But, I'm, like I said, I'm not staying on here long. I'm ready to eat my dinner. I ain't ate it yet. It's sitting here. The wife's warming it up. Her and the neighbor went and looked at that other house today, and there was nine people there to look at the same house. Yeah, they said my blood sugar was real low. He says he don't even know how I made it to the hospital. Well, I do get up. I mean, I don't work because, you know, I do use my walker. I do get up and walk around a little bit in my room, but I don't go far from the bed. I'm not going to lie there. Yeah, I didn't show up. I was rushed to the hospital, but my wife did. And the judge says that she couldn't talk to her because she's not on the lease. Well, hell, then that means she can't talk to me neither because I'm not on no lease. I never signed no lease with him or his mother. Me and his mother had a verbal lease, and he has no idea what, what the verbal lease was because he wasn't there when I rented this place. <coughs> yes, I do need to lose a few pounds. But really, guys, I went from... 340, 350, all the way to 280. So I think I'm doing pretty good. Last time we weighed in, it was 278. I heard he already is, Grease. 
Yeah, he's already gloating. He did a 30 minute show, huh? Two more bottles of drugs. Oh, this one's got a red label. May call drowsiness. Nas na Make sure you take with food. Yeah, well, I'm glad they didn't. I don't think the wife can handle me being out of here. Y'all should see me coming home. I started up the stairway and couldn't make it. My legs collapsed. I would literally had to crawl on my front porch in my house. And really, I kind of more, I didn't crawl. I rode to my bedroom. And then I took two of my end tables and used them to help me get up a little bit. He told me to lay off the pop, lay off the coffee, go straight water. He wants me on a gallon of water every single day. Yeah, he, well, he did get one of the renters out. I heard she's got to be out in two weeks. And I heard she's going to fight it. He didn't win nothing. Like I said, one of the girls left. And I'm next. He didn't win. He ain't winning no money. He ain't got no money. He ain't going to be able to fix these houses up. Clover, I am going to be packed and out of here before that court date comes. I didn't know coffee affects your blood pressure. Doctor says it does. My doctor said it does, and so does that pop. He wants me to leave them both alone and go straight to water. A gallon a day. I looked at him and laughed. He goes, what? I was like, me? Water? Closest I get to water is in my coffee. It's hanging, bum. Like I said, I ain't doing a long video, people. I'm just getting on here. I'm fucking not feeling good. I think it's all the drugs they gave me, the painkiller they gave me. Morning, Heather. I didn't make it to court, Heather. I collapsed on my way. I do too, Cindy Sue. Yeah, that might work security. I don't know.
<clears throat> he said my blood pressure was real low. He asked me if I blacked out, and I told him I didn't think so. I remember getting real dizzy, lightheaded, sweating real bad, and all of a sudden I remember waking up on the floor. I don't think I passed out. I remember the wife getting me a cold rag and dialing 911. Good morning, or good afternoon, Miss Kitty. Evening. So I got to go back to court next week, next Friday. Yeah, I was worried about myself when I hit the floor. Got a couple bruises across the back. And I was talking to the doctor. He says, there's nothing wrong with my legs. He thinks it's my back. That's making my legs bad. Yeah, and that's what he's telling me, handyman. Lay off the pot, lay off the coffee, and drink plenty of water. On my way to courthouse, kitty. Well, I had two cups that morning, and I literally rode over, got out of bed, got to the front door, and collapsed. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, and I literally on the it took me an hour to get back in my bed. I literally had to crawl through my house. Up the stairway on the front porch through the house to my bed. He'll just say it's my fault, Andy. I should have put him up there a long time ago. Hello, Mick. I was trying to get on while I was at the hospital, but she really said she wish I wouldn't with all the machines they had me hooked to. I mean, they had me hooked up to the heart machines and everything because they know that I have had two heart attacks and a triple bypass. So they literally hooked me straight to the heart machine. She was. Well, you got to remember, Andy, he's not going to do nothing to him. He's got them all up for sale the way I hear. Yeah, well, see... I wasn't in the hospital bed. I was in the emergency room. That's what someone told me, that he's got the houses up for sale. He's going to sell them all and get out of Kentucky really quick. He's going to go see J-Dubs. He's going to move in with J-Dubs and J-Dubs' wife. J-Dub's wife, you're going to have to share J-Dub's with Vaughn. I hope you like sharing your man. 
because you got another little bitch coming to share him. A little lightheaded, dizzy, headache, back hurts. They gave me a shot in the butt for the pain, but it didn't do too good. That's all he puts out there, handy men or lies. You know, that could have been what it was, too. Maybe it's one of my blood pressure medicines that made me do it because I got up too fast. I was getting ready to go to that courtroom. I wanted to get it done and over with. Find exactly how many days I have left. No, they were just told to move, Andy. Good morning or good evening, Mr. Gray. So your eviction is a certain thing I have to go back next week she was given two weeks No, I think he's going to evict me. I want out of here. That's literally I do. No, I want out of here quick as possible, Grandpa. Hell, we'll be lucky if I'm not starting to move the shit out tomorrow. Honey, oh, yeah, definitely, Grandpa. Turn that big one off. Thank you. Oh, I'm not. I ain't going to be doing much of anything, Andy. I'm going to pay somebody. Who's that? Oh. The man that ain't put my bike back yet? Yeah, and I won't never see it again. Dad, I don't need to go back to the hospital. I'm not going back to the hospital. 
I'm just saying I'm never going to see my fucking bike again because your brother took it out of the shed. Just like Viola, I'll never see her ladder again. I'll never see the fender of my truck again. You lied to me? What? He said the last time that we played was when we all was in Boomville. Last time we what? Play. Last time we play. He said the last time we played was him. The kids. The one they moved. I play with my kids all the fucking time. Y'all, I'm going to get off here. I'm going to throw this uh, whopper down my throat. I'll relax a little bit. Turn the fans back on. Get some comfortable. Um, I'll try to do a live tomorrow if I'm alive. I'm hoping I do. I appreciate it, everybody. I'll holler at you. Hopefully, I can get on tomorrow. And I'll be feeling a little better. And um, who knows? I'm If I get on tomorrow, it might only be for a few minutes. Because I might start having things move tomorrow. Who knows what I'm going to do. I'm going to start doing something quick. Y'all have a good day. Peace out. <laughs>